right, so we have all of our components here and ready. We have our flint and steel. This is actually a small steel that I made for myself that I carry in my pocket. I think uh, a lot of times steels are way bigger than they than they actually should be. This one's small, can be worn on a necklace, and it's a useful tool. Piece of Alabama chert rock. Our bird's nest of hay and grass, whatever dry things we can find around here. This is char cloth, which is just cotton cloth that's been charred to the point that it's carbonized but not burned. This is what's going to catch our spark and then we're going to make a, blow this into a coal and put it inside of this bird's nest, blow that up into a flame hopefully, and then from there with that flame light these pieces of fat lighter, fat wood, and then get us a little, little fire going before we light our coke and coal with that eventually. So first things first, let's get this char cloth going. So we hold our char cloth right here on top of our chert. See if I can get a strike at this angle. My elbows are kind of... Move that around find a better spot. Had a spark, gonna knock it off. I'm gonna have to stand up, I can't get up from here. Try another piece of char cloth. about beat that one to death, get a larger piece. Maybe that'll catch it. Would be better to have a larger piece of shirt, but that's just what I had in my pocket this morning. That's what we got. Cigarette lighter is definitely easier. Stand up. There we go. You can see it right there. I'm just gonna blow that into a little coal. Put it in our bird's nest. There's our flame. Now we have our flame. Let's get our little bits. Broke up pieces of wood, but now we've got our fat lighter going. There you have the traditional lit uh, coal fire, traditional lit fire. That's 
a little piece of, little piece of coke on here. We're just going to let that burn for a few minutes and get us some uh, wood coals down in there. And then once the wood coals are going, then we'll put our coke on top of it and get the, uh, get the forge going. I tell you, striking it down here with no elbow room just really doesn't work out. You really got to get some, some motion in there. Put our pieces back in our pockets. And I'm going to save you the, the waiting here, but you see the flame and we'll let that burn down and put some coke on top of there. And we'll get started on making some nails to fix those, uh, fix those shutters.